followers wherever you live in our big beautiful world well I have something to tell you uh, my throat is sore so I can't eat super hot for some days or week because I tried four days ago or, or if it was five days ago I had three Bach X Primo cream and they lay around a million each and I had had no problems with those but the day after I took a uh, trainer hornet and that made havoc with my throat and I had to take uh, some uh, drinkable yogurt and that's when I thought something was wrong with my throat I have been coughing very much lately uh, and uh, the day before yesterday I had a cappuccino naga and those are around eight to eight hundred thousand up to a million and that one really made havoc with my throat I had to take some ice cream because it was so hurtful and uh, last night when I decided no more super hots for some days I had a, another Trina Hornet and that one felt like the hottest hot pepper I've ever had and those lays around 1.2 million so my tolerance is not bad but my throat is sore and very in very bad shape because I have coughed so much the last four days so I'll try in this video to take a jalapeno so, to see how hurtful that one is but before I go to that I had a hot mail come in hot box come in and uh, I know this is from Chile Viking because of the postal code is wrong <laughs> I can't recall when he sent this to me but I think it was a week ago and today in this hot super hot weather we have in Sweden it has been lying in our post box mailbox all day with degrees up to 29 30 Celsius so I think and that they have been in the postal service service for so long they are in bad shape I think it's five golden primotalis in this one but let's open it up well let's see it says iPhone so hmm well, let's open it up to see what's inside. I don't know where to cut this one. Hmm. Yep. Where do you open it up? Ah, under the tape. <laughs> what the? Hmm. Uh huh. I've been doing it the wrong way.
Hmm, strange. Oh, very slimy and soft. This one looks real nice. Mm. Let's see, this one is not okay, I can see, I can tell. Not this one either. Chili Viking. And not this one either. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> well, one out of five was okay. <laughs> Better luck next time, Chili Viking. <laughs> but unfortunately, I can't take one of those right now because of my throat so i'll try a mexican jalapeno look at this gorgeous red one let's see if that one burns the crap out of my throat well thank you chili liking for the effort to send me <laughs> hot peppers <laughs> to the wrong postal code mmm jalapeno look at that gorgeous and it's itching like crap in my nose no I have not come down with anything maybe a minor cold or something it's very oily Lots of seeds on one part. It really smells like jalapeno. It was a very long time I had a jalapeno. It smells really nice. Earthy. Paprika. So, Mickey, Mickey's having to. Mexican jalapeno. Let's have it. Mm. Very nice tasting pod. Uh, very fruity. Um, real nice taste. Some sweetness to it too. Some burn on my tongue. And yes, I can feel my throat is not good. A jalapeno shouldn't do this to my throat. Um, this feels just like I'm having a Puchilokia in my throat, but only with a jalapeno. So, yeah, I do have <coughs> a very sore <coughs> throat. Um, or I should say, this is, the jalapeno feels just like I have eaten a butulokia with a very high tolerance. And the, the butulokia doesn't feel so much back of the throat or on the tongue when I have a high tolerance. Well, yeah, that, that was that. So, <coughs> I won't do any 
hot pepper testing or eating for a couple of days so you know I will come up with something else but I have promised you I will do hot stuff and uh, special places this weekend so I try this scotch brain to see how it will feel I will record the video tomorrow evening after my work until the next video in heat I trust take care out there and be safe goodbye <laughs>